A falling tree also killed a pregnant wife and mother. A celebration of life for Christy Oliver will be held this weekend, and our Amy Frazier met with her parents in Troutdale. Christy Oliver's parents say it warms their heart that her story has touched so many people in the community. They have a portion of the tree that took their daughter's life. They plan on having it made into a bench where they can sit and remember their daughter. I would give anything for to have her back. And I would give anything for no more families to go through this. Each day since a falling tree killed their daughter and unborn grandchild. Every day. Almost every minute. Christy Oliver's parents find themselves asking why. Somebody had said that God needed somebody to help watch over all his children up there in heaven. She was mom to a toddler, four months pregnant, and like a mother to everyone she knew. Anything that she could do, she was there, she'd take in everybody, you know. March 1st, a tree crushed Christie's SUV as she drove to work along Southeast Oxbow Road in East Multnomah County. Her parents say the tree-lined roadway needs to be made safer. A lot of people use that corridor and it could happen anytime. The weather and stuff that we've been having. Since their daughter's death, they've stayed away from this area, turning their focus to Christie's husband, Jeremy, and the couple's three-year-old son, Mikey. You know, he has some special needs. Um, he has celiac disease and um, she had to learn a lot about that. Friends, family, and even strangers have given more than $12,000 to a GoFundMe page to help Mikey thrive in his mother's memory. And for that, they are grateful. And he oh, will yes. grow up knowing how much she loved him. In Troutdale, Amy Frazier, Coin 6 